Welcome back to Ozarks Fox AM. We are live from the historic Landers Theater, and we are so honored to be joined by the amazing, legendary Kim Crosby. Oh my, legendary! Yes. yes. Hey, you're okay. a legend. Come on now. Because, Kim, you're an inspiration to so many people in this area who have that dream to go to New York and be on Broadway. And you did it. You're an example of that. Well, I did, but, I, but you know, I was very young. And I, I, think, I think you take a leap of faith when, when, you, when you head to New York because yes. uh, something, especially for us performers, uh, want to measure ourselves against other people in the industry. And, and, uh, you know, for whatever reason, I, I was hired eventually. I mean, I worked worked to, you know a couple of couple of restaurant jobs of for a yes, years of course. just yes. to make ends meet and pay my rent. But um, you know, fortunately, got picked up, and one one job led to another, and 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 I had a career, astoundingly. But. That's but amazing. Was, but now fortunate. you're back home, and when I these am. opportunities, I said uh, I saw you last in Mamma Mia, which you would just mention was two years ago, uh, wasn't it right? Yes, yeah, yeah two, two years, years ago, ago last fall. And uh, we were just talking that you do take these different opportunities out outside of town, but this is so great to get to perform in the in the city that you're from. It, it is, and and honestly, it's um, it's coming home for me. I just I I've been on this stage hundreds of times, mm -hmm. either in rehearsal or or in performance since I was. You know, seven or eight years old, so <laughs> so so this is very familiar. It's home to me, yeah. and and uh, shared the stage with my my late father, Don Crosby. He oh, had been yeah. in a number of shows, and many people here in Springfield yeah. know and remember him. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so it's so it's great, and 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 I love working with with friends of mine. Friends right. Of mine here on it stage. feels like a family yeah. here. It really does. It, it is. feels like the whole yeah. theater just well, the theater in general is a family. Once you get to right. work with somebody and, and do a show with them, it and is. Dolly Levi yeah. is such a an iconic character. <laughs> Did you have any qualms about taking it on? <laughs> Challenges. Well, I, yes. I say, are you sure? Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> because honestly, I mean, I'm, I'm not the, you know, as an actress, I'm, I grew up playing ingenues and, and uh, um, you know, throughout most of my career in New York. And, and, and I, I don't think that I'm the first person to come to mind when, when thinking of this role. But, but now that, that I've worn the role and lived in her, it, it's, it's fun. And I think th this role is going to be different. It's going to be unique. Uh -huh. You know, with every mm -hmm. with every actress who who plays her, and that's the fun part. You get to make yes. it your own yes. instead of copying what somebody else did or seeing that performance. Because a lot of people may have seen the movie, but every stage performance is different. A well, different take on Dolly. You know, yeah. I mean, I don't think of myself as a as a dame, but you know, <laughs> but I, I've tried to plumb you know parts of, of Dolly in myself, mm -hmm. and and I play her as as I you know as I would play her, and I've really really enjoyed. But that is the most challenging it. part and most fun is to try to draw out the character if it's not. Like who you are, regularly. You know, right. I mean, just to pull those aspects out. I think that's a lot of fun. Well, it is, and and, and it's a it's a challenge too. But but you just have to get out of your mind everything that you've ever seen, any yes. performance you've ever seen mm -hmm. of, of the the role, and mm -hmm. and just play. It. You know, she's still an honest person, and yes. and and so I I just bring who all that I am to the role, and, right. and that's that's all I can do. Uh, Kim, are there any differences? You know, I have been seeing theater in this town for years, and I love the people, and I love the talent in this town. Are there any differences from the Broadway stage to right here at the Landers? Well, you know, I, I often say, and, and I've always been so, so proud of, of this community theater, because it, it's just mm -hmm. far and away above the quality of, of your average community theater. Yeah, you know, there are just a lot of people, besides, as you said, there are a lot of people who have, have come up through the ranks here and, and gone on to professional careers. Mm -hmm. But but we're all here because we, we love being on stage. And, and really, right. this is where I learned, I cut my teeth on, on musical yeah. theater and where I learned uh, to love theater in, in general. And, uh, you know, I have to say, it, you, the show is the show. And, and, and the play is the play. You have to tell the story. All the, all the same, you know, whether you're on Broadway or, or um, right. uh, it's just that th there are so many incredible volunteers who right. work here, and, and it's just astounding to me what people pull together. And, and uh, mm -hmm. when you're living in New York, people do this for a living, yes. but here, they most, because most they everyone, yeah. m most of us work a full-time job, and yes. then come here in the evening with what you know, with what what we have left, and, yes. and, yeah. and create something happy and and joyful. And, and the music of this show is is. Uh, is stunning, and I'd worked with Jerry Herman, the late Jerry. Oh, you, oh my gosh, that's well, amazing! Well, my first Broadway show was was Jerry's Girls, wow. and yes. and it was a it was a you know uh, retrospective of his music, mm -hmm. and uh, and so I, I was able I met him, and oh, and, and, and it was incredible. That's amazing to, to work. I mean, with she him. didn't like to name drop, but like Stondheim, whatever. Yeah. She's <laughs> Peter Brook, that's Kim Crutch. She's humble. Yes. She's nice. Thank but, you, Kim. We <laughs> love thank you so much. You. Seriously. Thank you.